beautiful people. Welcome back. I'm so glad that you were here. Welcome to a day of unboxing. We have some last minute Halloween items. And as you can see outside, it is going to rain for the next three days. You guys, I got up so late today. I got up at seven o'clock. It is now 830 and it is still really dark outside. All right, Coco. Hi, say hello. Oh my gosh. How did you get to be so pretty? So if that's something that you're interested in, stay tuned. This is my outfit for the day. I did order this shirt from Poshmark. I love it. The Nightmare Before Christmas. And I do have my platform Crocs on. They not only give you two and a half inches of height, but they are very comfy. And in the background, I do have the movie Freaky playing with Vince Vaughn. I was invited to the premiere last year, and I'll try to link that video below and of course toy story yeah it is raining um actually it's like a perfect day to stay in and uh, kind of get a little cozy what are you doing do you want to wear these do you want to wear these <laughs> Hello beautiful people, I'm Therese and welcome back. I'm so glad that you guys are here. Welcome to a full day of unboxing. This is last minute items for Halloween and I just received this in the mail just the other day. Big shout out to Grandin Rhodes. Thank you guys so much for sending this to me. I really, I really do appreciate it. And I actually have a couple stories. So I hope that you will watch this whole video. This is probably going to be a little bit long of an unboxing because there's a lot of things to, um, there's a lot of layers to unpack right here. So grab a drink and light a candle and unbox with me. Okay. And I also want to give a shout out to Dashing Diva Gloss. Okay. So these are the, this is the gel palette. And it says it lasts up to 14 days. You get 32 of them in here. This is, I think this is around $9.99. I got it at Wally's, which is, you know, Walmart. You guys, I've had these on for like three weeks. I mean, they are absolutely fabulosity. So, I mean, I can't even believe that they lasted this long. Probably need to do, to do, redo them. Um, but yeah, I love them. So let's get started. So I did order, as you can see over here, <laughs> I did order a TV stand because when I did move, the movers broke it. And my friend Janina, hi Janina, she gave it to me and um, it just was glass, it was beautiful. And I was just really, really upset that they broke it. So the one that I did want was about, oh my gosh, you guys, it's probably um, close to $3,000 and uh, we did not order that. So I did order one from Walmart. And it was one of those like sliding um, barn doors and I opened it and first of all to even get it into my house you guys it was so heavy and after about four hours I realized it's just basically held together with pegs you kind of had to teeter everything and then are you gonna help me okay oh my goodness okay so we have a visitor this is Barbie okay go play and um, so anyways, after about four hours, I'm realizing that it's not going to work. So it was so heavy. The box was probably about eight feet long. It was actually bigger than this one here. And uh, so I dragged it into my car. I put a couple of pieces in the box and then the rest of it I did put in the trunk. And I had to drop it off at FedEx. And so here, ow, ow, you know. Mm -hmm. Now you gave me, okay, you bit me and then now you're kissing me. Okay. Okay. All right. Okay. So I put it in my trunk and I had to bring it to FedEx. So I brought it to FedEx and I literally brought the box in with a couple of pieces in there. Then here I am going back and forth to the car because I basically couldn't lift it. It's probably like 200 pounds. The guy in FedEx. Hi, Dan. Thank you so much. He actually let me, I brought my own tape and they actually, he actually let me use his, uh, like the, uh, how would you say, 
like the little gun, you know, that um, that you put a roll of tape in or whatever. I forgot what that's called. Anyways, so he let me use that. I taped it all up. I sent it back. And literally, I had $200 back into my account in two days. So, um, you know, it was just something that just didn't work for me. And, you know, it was really nice to uh, have that experience. So, some of these places that you order from, you cannot get your money back. And also, too, I did go to Home Goods the other day, and I bought Ray Dunn like a spice rack. And I was trying to put all of my item, my spices in the rack, but they wouldn't fit. And I even had some small ones, so I returned that. And then I also had a Halloween cup, and I found one with a topper, and so I kept that. So, and Home Goods, you know, they're so nice. If you return something and if you don't have your receipt, which I rarely return anything from Home Goods, um, they give you a gift card. So that was actually very nice. Oh my goodness. Okay, we're going to have styrofoam all over the floor. Okay, let's go this way. Oh, I see. I'm going to have to dump out the whole box. Oh, that's much better. Okay. Oh, okay, here's the sign. I, I did it again. I bought something else um, that I'm really not too happy with. So stay tuned. You'll see. Okay. Oh my gosh, you guys. First of all, Brandon Rose. Oh, these are amazing. Look at this. guys this is heavy okay so this is the broom and actually I'm so happy I thought this was going to be kind of like a regular like you know a regular straw broom you guys look at this and of course we'll have to undo they have all these twisties on here okay. cut this off This is pretty, this is heavy duty here. And I really love Brandon Road because everything is packaged so well. And if you do order something from them, believe me, it looks just like the picture. <sighs> okay. This is like ceramic, <sighs> heavy duty. Okay, you're having a ball in there, aren't you, Barbie? Okay. So I'm gonna go ahead and uh, put this together for you guys. This is, oh my God, guys, this is so cute. Look at this. Of course, we'll fine tune it later. Look how cute that is, you guys. This is, I mean, this is so amazing. Amazing. So heavy duty. And I just, oh my gosh, you guys, I just love this. Are you having a ball? Are you? Are you going to vacuum up all the uh, styrofoam for me? So, oh. You guys, this is so cute. So cute. So next up, I did order this online, and I knew it probably wouldn't be 
exactly what the picture looked like, but I didn't know it was going to be this bad. So check this out. So I ordered this in the mail and put this down here. I got all these parts here and I guess it was somewhat of a, of a learning curve. First of all, I mean, there's no way that this uh, is anything like that I would receive from Grandin Rose, okay? So what it was supposed to look like, it was supposed to be something to what was like a, a bell pepper shaped and there's no way, I mean look how small it is first of all, okay? So I guess, I don't know if this is like two in one or whatnot. I wasted 20 bucks. It didn't even come with any kind of shipping um, thing, which is um, a shipping invoice, which is which is a big red flag right there. So look at this. I mean, it's just, oh, and yes, thank you, Barbie, for scratching me. Okay, that's what happens when you have caps. Anywho, okay. So yeah, a little bit of a learning curve. I was like, okay, how does this go together? So the first thing that you can do, you can do is put these two together. And then you can hang this little sign here. So, I mean, okay, that's kind of cute, kind of, and then these go on the end. I mean, um, like, okay, so where is the stand that was, this was supposed to come? So then I was like, okay, this is a learning curve <laughs> because it came with this and you just put these little hooks in here, which keep falling out. So I guess this does go in here. Okay. So first of all, it's not as tall as they said it was going to be. And these are supposed to stay in here and they don't, they fall out. One is actually chipped, as you can see right here. And uh, so this is what it's supposed to look like. So yeah, here it is. I mean, this is, it's ridiculous. And I really don't understand why they do this. I mean, you want to dupe the public. Don't you want a returning customer? I don't, I, I don't get it. So um, yeah, I'm stuck with this and it probably would cost me $15 to return it. So what's the point? So yeah, I, I, I don't understand. I mean, wouldn't you want me as a returning customer? Because if I do like your items, I'm definitely going to repurchase. So that said, let's move on. Okay, so I went to Home Goods and did pick up a couple of things. First of all, this is so cute. This was $7.99. You guys came with a sleep mask. Look how cute that is. So cute. Adorable. Adorable. So I actually bought this at Walmart. And again, I love Walmart. I love the customer service. This is an LED bathtub light. It does come with a remote. And yes, I did remove this bottom piece right here. Um, this uses three AAA batteries. It's submersible. And now it's not working. So I'm going to return it. It was like around $10. So yeah, we're going to return that. And that's okay. We're just probably going to grab another one or maybe, you know, some more fairy lights. I did go to Walmart and I picked this up. I really do love Airwick. But I was a little disappointed. So I opened this up. This was $4.88. And you guys, this is only a clip right here. So, um, dear Eric, I do love you, but I think we can do a little better. So I'm going to go ahead and return this and I'm going to show you why. Hold please. 
They always put out coupons for free, like, air warmers. So I have this one, and I actually have, um, this is from Glade, you guys. I have a whole bag of these. I don't like when they get all poots and if they get all dirty. There's one, there's a different one. And these are free. So... I don't know, even if I didn't have all of these free things, I don't know, I would still return it, and, you know, I don't know. I mean, it's cute, but we're still going to return it. So, next up is Bath & Body. I did order a warmer from Bath & Body. You guys, look how cute this is. I'm going to go ahead, and I'm going to plug it in. This is so cute so cute I don't have any fragrance to put in here I'm still waiting for them to come but even if you don't I mean just look how cute that light is so cute okay so next up I have a package from confectionery soaps so if you guys want to order from her follow her on Instagram and you can see her future launches everything sells out so quickly I mean this is only my second package, and um, I love it. So this is um, the Spooky Season 2021. Look how cute it's packaged. Okay. So impressed. Everything that she has is handmade. She makes it herself. She hand paints all of these items. Oh my God, look at all this. We got some candy. I love this. How did you know? Look at that okay so cute her brochure the pumpkin crunch berry you know you guys I'm really excited for this I mean look look at this it's amazing so she lives in Maryland I believe look at this you guys hand paints all of those it's amazing okay <gasps> Oh my gosh. Okay, so this is the sugar lip scrub. This is the cotton candy. <gasps> oh my gosh, it's a sam oh my this is this supposedly is a sample. This is like this is like full size. Oh my gosh. Okay, that comes with a little spatula. Okay. Oh my gosh. Okay. Mm-hmm. I did use a lip scrub last uh this morning actually. I should have used my lip mask and uh probably would have been able to put some lipstick on today, but uh wasn't working for us today. Mm. So cool. Okay. This is candy corn kisses a sample. Oh, we have more candy. Never have enough candy, as I say. Okay. Look at how cute this is. Oh, it smells so good. Mmm, 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 mmm. Mmm. Passes, passes, I can't even talk today. Passes the taste test. Yes, love it. Love. Aww. So yeah, we ordered the Frosted Cranberry Lip Balm and a candle and we ordered a wax melt and a Romeo Bath Fizzy. So cute. I mean, just look, just, I don't know, I just, I love. So this is also vegan, the Frosted Cranberry. Go ahead and open this. Oh, it smells so good. I love cranberries. Because there's a lot of product in here too. Oh my gosh. See that? Oh my gosh, guys, I should have, 
I probably should have used this this morning. Mmm. Love that. Love. Okay, so next up. <gasps> look at that. Oh my God, you guys. Look at him. Look how cute he is. Definitely going to take a bath with this. This is the Romeo Bath Fizzy. And oh, he's so, look how cute he is. And he's all glittery. Let's go ahead and open him up. Oh my gosh, you guys. He's even like sealed, but you can still smell, smell it. Oh. oh my gosh. That's amazing. And all of the ingredients are here. Oh, it smells so good. Okay. Now, this is the first time I was um, able to get a candle. Her candles sell out like that. I mean, they sell out so quickly. So I'm going to go ahead and open this up. This is the Hay Sunflower. Oh, look at this. Oh my gosh, you guys, it smells so good. And it has the wooden wick right here and will crackle and, a, you know. Oh my gosh. The wooden wick, it will crackle and it sounds like a little fireplace. Amazing. And you're not supposed to burn a candle for more than four hours at a time, at least a couple of hours. Gosh, that's, that's amazing. Amazing. Okay, and then last but not least, we have the Glowing Ghost. Oh my gosh, they're so cute. Look at that. And this is what I love. You know, when you have... Good, when you sell good product, good quality items, I mean, look at that. That one cracks, so what? Oh, it smells so good. I'm not mad at it. It's okay. Mmm, it smells so good, you guys. So good. So when you order good quality items and... The customer service is just impeccable and the products are beyond. I'm going to be a repeat customer. So this, I mean, come on. Seriously, you really want to dupe us? I don't know. I mean, look at this. So, and you know, my channel is, is not about, ooh, look what I can buy or almost, it seems like a show and tell. It's to show you guys um, what you can buy, and I really do love supporting small businesses. As I did get this, this is the Nightmare Before Christmas, and I got it from Poshmark, this shirt right here, and I love it. So, I just really want to give a shout out to these businesses, and uh, I am definitely, definitely going to be a repeat customer. So I did pick these up from Home Goods. So this is Ray Dunn, the four piece mini spatula set, $6.99. Look how cute those are. Very well made. I believe this is bamboo, correct me if I'm wrong. And it is dish water safe. It says wash in warm water before use. So yeah, definitely have to wash these first. And then I found these, you guys, so cute. I love spatulas. I've been collecting these since I was a little kid, especially the antiques and wooden spoons. And then I did find these. These were $7.99. Ray Dunn, the five-piece mini utensil set, trick or treat. And I'm definitely going to be using this throughout the Halloween season and, of course, throughout November for Thanksgiving. So unless I find some that I really like, I'm probably just going to be using these. So thanks again, you guys, for watching. If you did enjoy this video, please give it a big thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe. Please leave a comment. It really does help me out. And click that notification bell because I am actually going to be doing my Halloween house tour tonight when it starts to get a little bit more dark out and uh, after I clean my house. So, <laughs> so I will see you guys really, really soon. And until next time, XO. Hello, my beauty. Hi.
Is that a love bite? You're welcome.